This is five Windows XP productivity tips that I use on a daily basis. Number one, quick launch. I use this all the time ever since I started using Windows XP. If you right click you can see you can lock the taskbar or unlock the taskbar. Typically there's the quick launch um, on it but if you need to access it you can uh, right click and go to properties and you can go to the uh, taskbar tab and click show quick launch click OK you'll see the icons down here now what I do is I pull this up make it two layers pull this down and lock the taskbar now I can just drag and drop different applications onto the for instance there's my command prompt and this way I have all of my applications at my fingertips any time of the day. Number two, taskbar shortcuts group. This is something I actually figured out just recently that's helped me on managing multiple projects shortcuts at the same time. Now uh, what it is is this shortcuts kind of grouping that I created. Uh, if I right click and go to toolbars, new toolbar, you can see that I can add a folder. And so as I'm adding this folder, I can add the uh, shortcuts panel. If I unlock the taskbar, you'll see I've got uh, all of my shortcuts in here. And if I shove it over to the side, here, let's get rid of this one. If I shove it all the way over to the side with my folder, and then I lock the taskbar, now I have a handy little icon here that I can click and look at all of my shortcuts here click at cake blog oh okay there I'm right there so that is number two number three taskbar shuffle this is just one little application that you can download uh, I'll put it on the uh, notes but it's just this taskbar shuffle you can uh, download it free it's quick easy simple installation what it does is I've always been annoyed that I can't just reorder things that I'm working on say I want to uh, say from the right to the left those are the things that I need to do say my emails first I can just drag it right over there I can reorder all of these and that is number three number four tabbed windows explorer this I will also link to it is uh, at this crazy I don't know open source thing website and we've got uh, QT tab bar this is one of my favorite applications it's saved me tons of time um, what it is is when I open a folder I have tabs so all I have to do here is control N and it adds another tab I can now go to my C drive and my shortcuts folder and say I want to make a shortcut to um, my games I would right click and drag and create the shortcut there and there it is my game shortcut now you will see down here my shortcuts I've got my game shortcut now this is very very nice because you don't have to have 15 explorer windows open and you can just sit here and tab between the two some other cool functionalities it has a search box you can uh, type in say if I want to type in uh, my games and it now filters all of my folders for the uh, folder that I'm looking for dynamically it also has a couple more functionality things in there like uh, you know if I hover over a um, a image it gives me a thumbnail I can click this and uh, browse through the images and as you see my images are popping up on the right hand side as a preview very very slick saved me a ton of time and number five is texter you'll see I have texter installed here and I can uh, manage my hot strings and for instance I'm at with a space I save that and enter in I'm at markmansky.com and click OK and now I can do M at and hit space and it automatically puts in my email address this has also saved me a ton of time I also have HD hit space bam markmansky.com thank you for listening to this screencast and 
I hope this will save you a lot of time in the future.